It was a violent Easter weekend in Jacksonville. Six shootings reported. Two of them were deadly. A 17-year-old died last night after he was found at the public's parking lot near 103rd and Ricker Road. News for Jack's reporter Brianna Andrews joins us live. And Brianna, police say the boy was shot at a nearby park. Officers say the teens were all together in McGirt's Creek Regional Park. Once the shots rang out, the teens and the victim drove to this parking lot. Officers found the teen with a gunshot wound and say the victim died on scene. JSO responded to the call around 6.40 p.m. At this time, police don't have any information as to why the teens were at the park or the reason for the shooting. There are no suspects. The shooting adds to the growing list of violence over the weekend. Earlier in the day, two men were shot and killed in the parking lot of a strip mall on Powers Ave. Police say there was a big gathering when an argument broke out and someone started shooting. No one has been arrested. Other violent attacks JSO is reporting from the weekend, a shooting on Roosevelt Boulevard around 1230 Sunday morning. Police say there was a car club meetup in a Winn-Dixie parking lot. At some point, a 17-year-old was shot and taken to the hospital. Four hours later, a shooting was called in from I-295 near Wilson Boulevard. A man called police saying he had been shot in the back. Police say he told them he was driving in that area and heard gunshots. Then he realized he was shot. Not even two hours later, officers were called to Hubbard near East 8th. A man was shot in the arm and taken to the hospital. Someone who lives on the street heard gunshots and called police. Saturday night around 1030, another 17 year old was shot in a parking lot on Normandy Boulevard. This is video of the scene. Police say there was a large group in a parking lot there when the shooting happened. And Jacksonville isn't the only area that experienced a violent weekend. Three mass shootings were reported nationwide, leaving two people dead and dozens injured. The shootings happened in South Carolina and one in Pittsburgh. Reporting live, Brianna Andrews, Channel 4, The Local Station.